welcome to Lady Mary Beth. Let's bake chocolate chip cookies using the classic Toll House recipe, incorporate a secret ingredient, and talk about other tips for showy and delicious cookies. Afterwards, we will surprise friends with lemonade and chocolate chip cookies in personalized packaging. Chocolate chip cookies are always a favorite. Cream two sticks of softened butter, and then add your sugars gradually. I like to scrape down the bowl in between. And then add your two eggs one at a time to make sure they're integrated. And the vanilla, my favorite addition. And here is the secret ingredient, more good vanilla. This is the Jello brand instant pudding. And make sure you add that before you add your flour mixture. And don't overmix because the batter can become tough if you do. It's just right. And mix in premium morsels by hand. I use Ghirardelli or Guitard, and I also mix in milk chocolate as well. And the recipe is linked in the description below, and it is available on LadyMaryBeth.com. A cookie scoop and still pat sheet are invaluable for baking chocolate chip cookies. They come off the pan quite easily and it makes for a nice texture. And the cookie scoop helps make the cookies uniform and they're just perfect that way and you're not fighting with two spoons. And this is the most important addition before they go into the oven. Three semi-sweet morsels packed tightly together. They will spread as they bake. And this way you have picture perfect cookies. And now we'll bake them for about 10 minutes. Oh, they look delicious. And you'll let them cool for about a minute and remove them to a cooling rack. And the baker always gets the first cookie. Oh, they're so delicious. Now that our cookies are baked and they've cooled on our drying racks, we are ready to personalize this with special packaging for our cookie delivery. These labels are from an Etsy seller, Moonlit Printables, and it's a wonderful, affordable way to personalize anything. And we're using bakery boxes that I found on Amazon, very simple, easy to put together with the window. And here is our finished product. We don't even need a ribbon. It's absolutely ideal. It's not too large, so we don't have to put too many cookies inside, just enough for a family to have a nibble and enjoy along with their lemonade. Look at the difference. Here we've put our three semi-sweet morsels on top of the cookie to add a little panache for presentation. They're both equally delicious, but you can see the difference. This is ready for the cover of a magazine. So now it is time to package our cookies. We've got our box assembled with our custom Cookies by Mary Beth personalized label from Moonlit Printables on Etsy. And what I like to do is put a sheet cut to size of wax paper in the bottom because after all there are two sticks of butter in the cookies. And you want to make sure that they've cooled and that the morsels are not glossy. Otherwise they might uh, rest on top of each other and not present as well. So here we will place them, maybe the larger ones on the bottom, place them in our box, just like so, and just keep stacking as many as you can fit or are willing to give. That's a great amount. Here we've got uh, plenty for a family of four, for example. And then we will close that up. It's very easy. It tucks in on the sides and in the front. And there we have our cookies ready for delivery. We're adding a touch to the lemonade to make it just look a little bit more of a presentation than just off the grocery store shelf. And I've taken three strands of raffia and we will just tie that into a simple bow and we'll end up cutting a lot of it off. Raffia is not very giving, so you can't really move the strands too well. So we'll just clip that off and now we have something that is ready for presentation. And it's so nice with our cookies and personalized label. It's time to go ring some doorbells.
we've made two cookie deliveries and one more to go. I sure had fun. I hope that you enjoyed learning some tips and tricks for enhancing the classic Toll House chocolate chip cookie recipe and seeing the versatility of packaging and labels and how you can really make it your own and do good for others. We've made three cookie deliveries and I think everyone was surprised and happy who doesn't love chocolate chip cookies. And I hope that you enjoyed learning some tips on how to enhance the classic Toll House recipe and how to present with a personalized label in the bakery box. Thanks for joining Lady Mary Batten.